Welcome back to the 7 on 8. We have another Ask Ellen segment for you tonight, trying to keep the kids learning while they're home from school. Today's question comes from Brock and his little sister, Cammy. I love the costumes, first I do and too. foremost. Yep, and tornado yeah. storms. So, Brock, you're not the only person to ask about tornadoes. And thankfully, we haven't seen too many mm -hmm. in West Michigan in the last five years. One of the reasons why is we don't live in Tornado Alley. So even though we can see tornadoes, we don't see them very frequently. Let's go ahead and tell you about how they come together and how they form. So here's an example of a tornado and a tornado will suck everything into it and loft it into the sky. These are associated with the strongest thunderstorms on the planet called supercells. And so to get a tornado, you have to have one of these supercells that spins. Spinning storms that create tornadoes are made when wind flows in different directions. Over time, the sunshine will heat the ground and create big thunderstorms to grow and take those wind uh, directions and ingest it up into the cloud. So as this happens, it creates spin in the atmosphere and the sun will tilt that spin and have the entire thunderstorm rotate. So that's what creates the strongest thunderstorms, the types of thunderstorms that produce tornadoes. And if you get it to spin just right and the conditions are just right, then a supercell can form a tornado as part of that storm. So first you need a thunderstorm, then you need wind shear, and if everything comes together correctly, then you can get a tornado. So thank you for the question, Brock and Cami. I hope that this helps. And those images are incredible too. Yeah, isn't Just that to neat? show how it all forms. Yeah, yeah, it starts with a horizontal wind, yeah. and then you have to wait for it to go vertical. It's like part of the tornado dance that we do for <laughs> weather experience. Yeah. You start like this, and you go like this. <laughs> Anyway. It's a good way to learn, though. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, Alan, thank you. If you want to submit a question for this segment, you just need to send us a video. You can email it to the 7 on 8 at woodtv.com. You can also tag us on Facebook or Twitter if you put it on social media.